how do we set preferences in Xcode? We can go ahead and change the size of the names, the comments, we can change the color, we can change the background. You know, we can have Xcode as we wish. So here we go. I open the Xcode project. Okay, some project and see basically the text size is too small here and uh, i would prefer a bigger size mm, say i have a bigger monitor i can go for a bigger size or um, i can also even choose different colors because i don't basically like this you know black and white combination all this can be set so how do we do it is here go to this menu bar and click on xcode there choose preferences this is a tab where you can choose here sometimes the other tabs would be selected as a general would be selected or something so go ahead and tap on fonts and colors so what we see is the basic thing these are all the templates which comes inbuilt when we install an X code so the default uh, set will be the basic template it tells the plain text will be this color of this size comments would be of this uh, yes of mono regular 13 size of green color strings would be of you know of this font this size and red color Say I want this comments to be of you know really big size so that I notice it and I don't miss it. So I choose on comments, go to the text editor. Now I choose the size to be say 36. I just close it, close it, bingo. Here we see the text size of comment is increased. So, but this is not you know very good i just see the comment size is increased i basically want all the sizes to be increased that can be done i again go to preferences see fonts and colors are selected now you know tapping on each thing and changing it one by one is practically not a good idea so we can just do select one thing and do command a I repeat select one thing and do command a command is basically going to select everything that is in this list so I've selected everything now I can go to text editor and choose the size I want I really don't want it to be very small or very big so I choose 18 they should be fine I can even use the scroll which is there so basically going up makes it big size in size and coming down a small size. You can also see I'll say drag that text size is being previewed here. So say I'll say drag you can preview the text size I say drag. So okay. So this size seems fine. I just close I say yeah this is good enough very easy to see so now what if i'm so bored with the white background and the you know the very familiar black and white combination thing i, I want a different color i can even do that with x code i again go here preferences fonts and colors i have other templates preset say i choose something like midnight oh which has got black background which all funky colors and exciting I can set this it gives me you know a kind of new feeling as if I am a fresh coder this is great now what if I don't like um, say the comments are in green color I want the I want the comments to be in say what do we choose some orange color I can go preferences midnight comments and change the color here to some you know fluorescent yellow color done here you go wow 
so what if i i do not want to you know mess up with the pre-existing templates but i want to create you know play around with color combinations and see how it looks i want to create my own template we have options here which tells go and i just choose bay template which gives the basic minimum combination and say my favorite template and I go, I want everything to be same as such, but um, you know, I want my comments alone to be of really this size and I want to change the color to a bright red and then you know i also want to change the background i don't want it to be you know so much of white mm, i want it to be something this or this or this this should be fine or something like this and this current line is the whatever we choose selection is whatever choose and what is this current line exactly okay i'll go ahead and mark it bright right okay so it shows where the cursor stays so wherever the cursor stays i want it to be in red and selection i want it to be in green and cursor color oh my god look at this i can even change this so I go and drag it to get all beautiful colors and I'll say I want the cursor to be in blue color done. Wow nice I just close we'll have a look. Oh the current line is in red you can see the cursor is in blue color and the selection is in green the comment this is very superb I can just set everything I can choose every color I would love to see when I'm coding this brings a great mood for coding hope you enjoyed this video go ahead have fun with colors have fun coding see you again take care goodbye